In Isaiah chapter 55 verse 8 it reads, For my thoughts are not your thoughts, neither are your ways my ways, declares the Lord. Verse 9, For as the heavens are higher than the earth, so are my ways higher than your ways, and my thoughts than your thoughts. One of the things that we need to understand is the ways of God and the thoughts of God, none of us will ever be able to understand or perceive. When you look into the Bible, when you try to understand how God works, it makes no sense. When you look at God feeding 5,000 men plus women plus children, he takes five loaves and two fish. Does that make sense? No, does not make sense. When God raises up Gideon to go and fight the enemy, what does he do? He tells Gideon to take those 300 men to fight those people that are above a lakh. 300 men absolutely makes no sense, right? When you look into scriptures in Deuteronomy chapter 32 verse 3, we read one chasing a thousand and two ten thousand. The math makes no sense, right? I want to tell you God's ways, God's thoughts, you and I will never be able to understand. We just need to learn to trust in Him. Learn to just let Him lead us. Sometimes you may feel you don't have enough resources, but I want to tell you, if you look up to heaven, you and I will begin to understand that it's not about what you and I have, but it's about what God has and what God can do. I want us to rest in God, rest in God, knowing that God is fully able to take you through whatever you are facing right now. It may make no sense to you, but trust God that he knows what he is doing. And once again, I want to say, his ways will make no sense. You know, when you have less, he will still say so. When you have little in your hand, yet he will say, dream big. You see, God is fully able to fulfill, to bring to pass all that he has spoken. And it's not dependent on what your abilities are, but on what God is able to do. So next time you see that you have limited resources, look to heaven because with God, you have limitless resources, limitless abilities. God can do all things. Dream big, think big because God is big. So don't ever, don't ever let your thoughts and your ways come in the ways of God. That will only limit you let God be God in your life. God bless you.